plastic. Our food's literally covered in it. But when it comes to recycling, it's the material that confuses us the most. I'm in Oxfordshire with the crew to find out which plastics really are recyclable. Good morning! Good morning. Helen Bird is the Recycling and Collections Advisor at RAP, the Waste and Resources Action Programme. This is the plastic from our Food Unwrapped team and this is their plastic waste. Yeah, well, Kate, I can well believe it. Every year, around two million tonnes of plastic is placed on the market to be used to package household goods. That's a lot of plastic. But surely the best place to go for advice on recycling at all would be the product's labels. So do people see that and think that that means you can recycle? This one here, called the Green Dot, what it means is the company that's placed this piece of packaging on the market has contributed financially to the recovery of the packaging, but in countries in Europe. Gosh! So how good are we at really knowing which plastic's recyclable? Well, there's only one way to find out. Ask the public. Welcome, Alicia, to our recycling challenge. We've got two bins, and our recyclers have got 30 seconds to sort their plastic. Every time you get it wrong, Helen is going to sound... You ready? Three, two, one... Recycle! Oh, 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 nearly, oh, oh. Nearly. <laughs> Are you sure you didn't get this out of my bin? Ah! That's recycling. Oh, uh. <laughs> oh God! And time! Helen, you were very busy with that klaxon. So, where exactly are we going wrong? OK, so here we've got a plastic tray. Now, the tray itself can go in for recycling, but this film lid here, that can't be recycled and so really needs to be removed before it can go on to be recycled. Here's another example um, where, you know, a lot of people think that you can recycle black plastic. However, at the moment, can't be recycled. What? I find that shocking. We get through 1.3 billion black plastic ready meal tubs and fruit trays every year. And this is just one of the many plastics that can't currently be recycled. To find out what's going on, I'm heading to a large recycling plant on the outskirts of Bristol. Hi, Adam. Nice to meet you. Hi, okay, how are you? Adam Reed is the external affairs director here. And I don't want any jokes about his job being rubbish. This place is absolutely fantastic. It's fantastic, isn't it? There are around 100 plants like this all over the country, which process the 1.5 million tonnes of plastic waste we create every year. So much rubbish here. It's uh, that resource. Resource. This is I all quality that. material. This particular plant deals with 250 tonnes of recycling a day, and it's all about sorting the many different types of plastic. And that process begins at the picking station. We're picking off things that are going to block up the, uh, the equipment. What on earth? Wow. Hmm. <laughs> Recycled pants, anyone? I'm not sure even Adam can do anything with those. Not bad, not bad fit. Oh, thanks. Rogue pants aside, this place is using some clever technology to separate all these materials. So what is happening here, Adam? So this is where we're sorting the different plastic types. An infrared beam instantly spots the type of plastic in milk bottles, and a burst of air then pings them off the conveyor to another sorting section. Oh! They are literally just being launched into that bin at the end. This type of plastic in milk bottles, called HDPE, is really worth recycling. So a bale would be worth maybe 100, 120 pounds. 120 quid for a bale? For a bale of this, yeah. Now you're talking. I mean, that's pretty good, isn't it? But some plastics have no resale value to recyclers at all, and so will just be incinerated. You'll see just how much of that black plastic we've had in just the last hour or so. Look at all of that. Look. Them. The black plastic just doesn't work with infrared, and that is a classic example of a material that's too problematic for the system to deal with. The carbon in black plastic isn't visible to the infrared sorting scanners in these plants, so any of this plastic is just discarded as waste. As a result, an estimated 60,000 tonnes of black plastic is incinerated every year. So, bottom line, this black plastic just is not recyclable in this country right now. No. It just seems like absolute madness.